it was just like really hard to let that go. I think I was depressed for like a day or two when I like finally said it, like it's dead. Just let it go, and I was able to move on. I was able to move on, move on, move on. You know, you're good. No, you're good. You can work, work it, work it. Right. Uh, uh, just show up to work, and that's. That's all you really need to do. Fuck all that. Just realize you don't need it. Just don't need a lot of the bullshit that you're doing. Like, I'm in my 50s, I got no clothes. And then I just rebuilt my whole wardrobe from the thrift store when I was back home for the last three years. And I can't tell you how freeing it is because I let go of my old stuff. Uh, all those memories attached to those clothes. Oh, so and so, my sister gave this to me. Oh, I was wearing this in this place. Oh, that girl's with me, you know. Like, I just all gone. And I went in and just got all new clothes that look good on me. Learned how to pick clothes out much better. I let go of my pants. Very important to keep growing professionally in the way you see yourself, the way people see you. Because it changes how people look at you. you know, when you go home, pay close attention to what people say about your hair. People say about your hair. And some people will say, oh, you should grow it again. And then just think, is it because it looks so good? Or is it because they want the old show? Is that what they want? You know what I mean? Just think about it. When people say things, it, it lets you know a lot. There comes a time in every boy's life when he must decide to be good or bad. And a big, strong boy like Joseph can be very good or very bad. He needs a vision quest to guide him. Vision quest? All cultures have a similar rite of passage. Your people have a bar mitzvah. Uh, we're not Jewish. Really? You know what I forgot to tell you guys? For you young guys that are like, like kind of just lost in the abyss, go drink alone. I used to do that all the time. I thought it was the coolest thing I ever did. Go drink alone. Like, it forces you to, to talk. It forces you to be a human. Um, and I mean that, man. I really mean that. Go out there and like, live alone for a little bit. Just be by yourself. I quit my job a little too early this year and I played 40 chess and I fucking lost. Meaning, I fucking, I should have stayed in my job. I shouldn't have did what I did. And I, and I fucked up and I, I, I wore it. Heaven. I was pretty fucking bummed out this year. I know the superintendent, the master superintendent, he's going to be a guest on this show. We're going to build some skyscrapers live with you guys. Um, here, he's, a, he's a skyscraper builder friend. I'm not sure yet. Billy, my buddy Billy Wilbur. He's the fucking man. Do you do like skyscraper review? That would be cool. Help. You're going to work for free for a couple of days, but there's not a human being that will just take, keep taking free labor. Only women will do that. Any ideas? I don't know, bro. You're fine. You got the centra paid off. Big deal. Um, you're fine. Chill, you're young, bro. Enjoy yourself. Develop an eye for things you like. 